Wake up! Sun on your face. The warmth of the first light of day gently nudges you awake, a reminder that a new adventure is about to begin. Hear the sounds of the African savannah. The symphony of nature with birds chirping and distant animal calls fills the air, creating a soundtrack that is both soothing and exhilarating. This is the real deal, Kenya, a land of breathtaking beauty and untamed wilderness where every sunrise brings a promise of discovery. We're starting our epic road trip from here. With our car packed and spirits high, we set off on a journey that will take us through the heart of Africa. Destination, the tip of South Africa. Our goal is clear, but the path is filled with countless stories waiting to be told. Thousands of miles, every climate imaginable, adventure awaits. First up, the savannah. From arid deserts to lush forests, we will traverse a continent rich in diversity. Think vast grasslands, acacia trees dotting the landscape. The savannah stretches out before us, a sea of golden grass punctuated by the iconic silhouette of acacia trees. It's hot here. Dry season means dust devils dance across the road. The heat is intense and the dry season brings with it swirling dust devils that seem to have a life of their own. But it's also incredibly alive. Despite the harsh conditions, the savannah teems with life, each creature playing its part in this vibrant ecosystem. Elephants, giraffes, lions. They all call this place home. Majestic elephants, graceful giraffes and powerful lions roam freely, embodying the spirit of the wild. We're not just driving through, we're experiencing it. We immerse ourselves in the environment, setting up camp and interacting with the local wildlife, making memories that will last a lifetime, feeling the heat on our skin, the sun's rays are relentless, and the sweat on our brows is a testament to the raw power of nature, smelling the dry grass and the dust. The scent of dry grass and dust fills our nostrils, grounding us in the reality of this untamed land. This is raw, wild Africa. Untouched and unspoiled, the savannah is a reminder of the beauty and brutality of the natural world. It gets under your skin, stays with you long after you've left. The experience leaves an indelible mark, a connection to the land that lingers long after the journey ends. This is just the beginning. As the sun rises once more, we prepare for the next leg of our journey. Filled with anticipation and excitement, our adventure is just starting and the open road beckons. The horizon calls to us, promising new experiences and unforgettable moments. We've got a long way to go, with so much more to see and experience. Each mile brings us closer to our destination, but also deeper into the heart of Africa. Fasten your seatbelt, it's going to be one wild ride. Buckle up, because this journey is far from over, and the adventure of a lifetime awaits. The landscape changes as we drive, the lush green fades, slowly giving way to a more arid and rugged terrain. The transformation is gradual yet unmistakable, as if nature itself is preparing us for the journey ahead. The lush greenery gives way to red earth and an endless blue sky. The contrast is striking, almost surreal, as if we've entered another world entirely. The red soil beneath us is rich and vibrant, a stark contrast to the deep unending blue above. We're entering desert territory, northern Kenya, home to the Samburu people. This land is as ancient as it is unforgiving, a place where only the resilient can thrive. The Samburu, with their rich traditions and deep connection to the land, are a testament to this resilience. Pastoral nomads who navigate this harsh land with incredible skill, their knowledge of the terrain passed down through generations is nothing short of remarkable. They move with a grace and purpose that speaks of a deep understanding of their environment. The sun beats down, temperatures soar, the heat is relentless. A constant reminder of the harshness of this land. Every step, every breath is a test of endurance. This is a test of endurance. For us and our vehicle, the desert is unforgiving and every mile we cover feels like a small victory. The sweat on our brows and the heat radiating from the ground are constant companions. But there's a stark beauty here, a sense of isolation that's both humbling and exhilarating. The vastness of the desert with its endless horizons and silent expanses offers a unique kind of freedom. It's a place where you can truly feel the weight of the world fall away. We meet some Samburu children, their eyes are bright with curiosity. They are the future of this land and their resilience is evident in their every action. Despite the harsh conditions, their spirits are unbroken, their smiles genuine. They're used to the harshness of this land, their survivors, their daily lives are a testament to their strength and adaptability. Whether playing or working, they move with a confidence that comes from knowing they belong here. We share some water, a few laughs. In this harsh environment, such simple acts of kindness take on a profound significance. It's a reminder that even in the most challenging conditions, human connection and compassion can thrive. It's a reminder of the resilience of the human spirit. The ability to find joy and connection even in the most challenging circumstances is a testament to our shared humanity. 
As the sun begins to set, the sky explodes in a riot of color, oranges, reds, purples. The beauty of the desert at sunset is unparalleled, a daily miracle that never fails to inspire awe. It's a sight that takes your breath away. The colors shift and change, painting the sky in hues that seem almost otherworldly. It's a moment of pure magic, a reminder of the beauty that can be found even in the harshest places. The desert may be unforgiving, but it's also undeniably beautiful. Its beauty lies not just in its vastness and isolation, but in the small, resilient life forms that call it home. From the hardy desert plants to the resilient Samburu people, the desert is a place of hidden wonders and profound beauty. We climb higher, the air gets thinner, cooler. We're heading towards the roof of Africa, Mount Kilimanjaro, Tanzania. This majestic mountain dominates the landscape. Snow-capped peak piercing the clouds. The air is crisp and clean. We trek through lush rainforest, waterfalls cascade down the mountainside. The change in climate is dramatic from the scorching desert to this cool, verdant paradise. We encounter hikers, their faces are etched with determination. They're on a mission to conquer the mountain, to test their limits. It's a reminder that we're all capable of incredible things. As we reach higher altitudes, the vegetation thins, giving way to rocky terrain and glaciers. The air is thin, breathing is a challenge, but the views are breathtaking. We're on top of the world. Back on the road, our journey takes us through bustling cities. Nairobi, Dar es Salaam, concrete jungles teeming with life. The air is thick with exhaust fumes and the sounds of humanity. The contrast to the wilderness is stark, but it's a reminder of the diversity of Africa. From the vast savannas to these modern metropolises, each with its own unique character. We escape the city, head towards the coast. The air becomes heavy with humidity. The smell of salt water fills our nostrils. We reach the Indian Ocean. Turquoise water stretching as far as the eye can see. The beaches are pristine. Palm trees sway in the breeze. We relax, soak up the sun, enjoy the slower pace of life. It's a welcome respite from the challenges of the road. The road beckons once more. We leave the coast behind and head south towards the Namib Desert, one of the oldest and driest deserts on earth. Namibia, a land of stark beauty and unforgiving conditions. The landscape is surreal, towering sand dunes sculpted by the wind over millennia. The silence is deafening, broken only by the sound of the wind whistling through the dunes. We encounter strange and wonderful creatures, desert-adapted elephants and beetles that collect moisture from the air. Life finds a way, even in this harsh environment. As night falls, the desert transforms. The stars blaze with an intensity rarely seen elsewhere. The Milky Way stretches across the sky like a river of light. It's a humbling reminder of our place in the universe. Our journey takes us inland, into the heart of Rwanda, we're here to meet the mountain gorillas. These gentle giants are critically endangered, but thanks to conservation efforts, their numbers are slowly increasing. We trek through dense rainforest led by experienced trackers. The air is thick with humidity and the sound of insects fills the air. Finally, we come face to face with a gorilla family. They're magnificent creatures, powerful yet peaceful. We observe them as they go about their daily lives, feeding, playing, grooming each other. It's a privilege to be in their presence. The encounter is a reminder of the importance of conservation, of protecting these incredible animals and their habitat. It's an experience that will stay with us forever. Section 7. The Smell of Rain. We continue south. The landscape changes once again, from arid desert to lush grasslands. Botswana, the Okavango Delta, a vast inland delta flooded annually by the Okavango River. The air is thick with the smell of rain, the sound of birdsong fills the air. We board a Mokoro, a traditional dugout canoe, glide through the waterways. Surrounded by water lilies and reeds, the delta is teeming with life. Hippos wallow in the shallows, crocodiles bask in the sun, elephants come to drink. It's a wildlife paradise. We camp under the stars, listen to the sounds of the African night, the distant roar of a lion the trumpeting of an elephant. It's a symphony of nature. Section 8, Victoria Falls, the smoke that thunders. Our journey takes us to one of the natural wonders of the world, Victoria Falls, known locally as Moziwatunya. The smoke that thunders, Zimbabwe, a truly awe-inspiring sight. The Zambezi River plunges over a precipice, creating a deafening roar and a cloud of mist that can be seen from miles away. We stand in awe of the power of nature. The falls are a sacred sight for the local people. They believe that the mist that rises from the falls is the breath of their ancestors. It's a place of great spiritual significance. We take a dip in Devil's Pool, a natural infinity pool perched right on the edge of the falls. 
The view is breathtaking. The adrenaline rush is unforgettable. Section 9 Wildlife Encounters. Our road trip is coming to an end, but not before we experience one last wildlife spectacle. Kruger National Park, South Africa, one of the largest game reserves in Africa. We spend our days on safari, tracking lions, elephants, leopards, rhinos and buffaloes, the big five. We witness incredible scenes of predator and prey, the circle of life in action. One evening, we're lucky enough to witness a kill. A pride of lions brings down a zebra. It's a brutal but necessary part of nature, a reminder of the rawness and power of the wild. We leave Kruger National Park with a renewed appreciation for the importance of conservation, of protecting these incredible animals and their habitat for future generations. Section 10, Africa's beating heart. Our epic road trip has come to an end, but the memories we've made will last a lifetime. We've traveled thousands of miles, crossing borders and experiencing the vastness of this incredible continent. From the savannas of Kenya, where the wildlife roams free, to the endless deserts of Namibia, where the sands stretch as far as the eye can see. From the dense green rainforests of Rwanda, teeming with life, to the serene coastal plains of South Africa, where the land meets the ocean. We've experienced the full spectrum of Africa's climates, each one more breathtaking than the last. From the scorching heat of the Sahara Desert, where the sun blazes down, to the cool, misty air of the mountain ranges that rise majestically. From the dense, humid canopies of the rainforests, alive with the sounds of nature, to the dry, arid landscapes of the deserts, where silence reigns. But more importantly, We've experienced the heart of Africa, found in its vibrant marketplaces and the daily lives of its people. The warmth of its people, their smiles and hospitality have touched our hearts deeply. The richness of its cultures expressed through traditional dances and colorful festivals has left us in awe. The diversity of its wildlife, from the majestic lions to the gentle giants like elephants and the graceful giraffes, has been a sight to behold. And the raw beauty of its landscapes, from the thundering Victoria Falls to the iconic Table Mountain and the vast Serengeti Plains. Africa is a continent that gets under your skin, leaving an indelible mark on your soul. It's a place of adventure where you can go on safaris, trek up mountains or raft down wild rivers. It's a place of challenge, pushing you to your limits. It's a place that will stay with you long after you've left, calling you back to its heart time and time again.